this week's feast. Kill a kill crockets. So everybody's been asking for this feast in the comments. That's right, but before we launch into it, did you guys know that you have the opportunity to win a free trip to Los Angeles to film a video with us? If you haven't seen our Walmart game day dip video, then I recommend you check it out right after this. You have until December 14th to enter. Yeah, all you have to do is come up with your own creative take on dip to enter the Walmart MVP contest submitted on Instagram or Twitter. All of the details right here. Or you can wait till the annotation at the end of this video because I know you guys want to check out these kill la kill croquettes. Oh yeah. We may not have access to the full size scissor blade. But don't worry, because we have our own version of the rending scissors. <sighs> The secret behind Mama Monk and Shoku's croquettes is simple. They're made with whatever is left over and lying around in the kitchen. From the anime, we can deduce that she makes a regular croquette with some carrots and greens and then adds in some other crazy ingredients like oranges, shrimp, a fish head, broccoli, and calamari. Today we're going to take a traditional croquette recipe and show you how to upgrade it with the Monk and Shoku family twist. Grab your rending scissors and let's cook! Here are today's selections of veggies. Use a peeler or your scissors to skin the zucchini and carrots and then mince them up alongside the bell peppers, onions, and garlic. Oh, we also have a fish. Look at this piece of work. Melt some butter in a frying pan on medium heat and add your veggies in one by one. Saute them until they are soft and cooked through. In a large pot, bring water to a boil and add the peeled, chopped potatoes. Let them cook for 10 to 15 minutes. Drain the water and mash them with a fork. Add in the sautéed veggies and stir until they are evenly dispersed throughout. Make a croquette by grabbing about a palm full of the mixture and rolling it into an oval or egg shape. In classic Feast of Fiction fashion, Ashley made a heart and shaped it with her scissors. Here's something cool, we're going to make the hot dogs look like calamari, which is a technique that's also seen in bento boxes. Cut the ends into 6 or 8 equal sections like a pie, and then shape a croquette around it. Stick your prepared croquettes in the freezer for 10 minutes, and then let's take them down the assembly line. Start with a light coat of flour, cover it in an egg wash, and finally roll them around in panko breadcrumbs until they are completely covered. Bring a pot of vegetable oil to 350 degrees Fahrenheit and add the croquettes a few at a time. They'll fry very quickly in about 30 seconds seconds to a minute. Add in the other special croquettes and watch the magic happen. The hot dog calamari curls when it cooks. How cool. If you want to get crazy, you can also make the orange croquette. And of course, we can't forget to fry our favorite little fish as well. That certainly looks, uh, appetizing. Voila, our authentic mystery monk and shoku croquettes from Kill La Kill. These were super fun to make and feel free to add whatever mystery ingredients you want and make them your own. Now, let's eat. Yeah! We did it! This was a very intense feast. Yeah. And I'm very excited to eat it. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna dip this in some tonkatsu sauce. And I'm gonna hook mine up with some sriracha. Yo, give me a little sriracha too. You got it. Boom! Oof! It's a heck of a bite. <laughs> it is a big bite. Cheers! Mmm. Mmm-hmm. Mmm, sriracha is a nice addition. I dig it. I don't mind it. I'm just gonna eat the, uh, this oh one. man, that hot dog, that's amazing. Calamari hot dog, baby. Mm-hmm. Octo dog. Octo dog. Octo arms. <laughs> okay guys, it's time. It's what you've been waiting for, folks. Mr. Fishy. Oh, and the tail. This used to be one fish. Oh my God. Oh. Ugh, we didn't take the bones out of it because this was just for show. But for the sake of the show, I'm gonna eat it. Yes, he's gonna take two bites out of crime. One bite out of this crime and one bite out of this crime. <laughs> I have to do both? Yeah. <laughs> I did not sign up for this. You ready? Oh, smells like a fish. You ready? Not you too got much. This. Just give you me got a... this. You got this. Give me a dab. Just a dab? Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. Ooh. Oh. oh my goodness. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, oh. my word. Oh. Here, 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 here. Oh. What the heck? It's salty. Look I... at that bite. That is <laughs> repulsive. <laughs> Am okay, I doing here the tail now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's a good bite right here. <laughs> oh my gosh. This isn't as bad. Oh my gosh. Really? Which is good? Really? <laughs> really? <laughs> That's fine. Oh my goodness. Now, wow, you are a true team player and you're still tail, eating it. This tail section is much better. Oh, look. Oh, I feel like there's like fish pieces in there. There are definitely fish pieces still in here. But... Wow. And he's just going to town, guys. Yeah. What a team player. Much better than the, the head. You lick the bones clean.
Thank you.